right guys, hope you're all doing well as usual. So I'm on to start with you covering my envelope journal. So we'll try and get the front and back covered with the book page. And then we might see if we've got time, then I will um, seal it. So last time I used matte medium and I really like the finish on it. So I'll probably do that again this time, but you could use your um, um, PVA would be fine as well. Anything like that just strengthens it a bit, especially around the windows since, you know, the outside cover gets bumped and that a bit more. I think it's a bit easy to clean off too if you get anything on it. So we'll get into that. So we'll start with the front. Now I've just got just a whole lot of scraps here today rather than the massive pile Mount Kosciuszko of book pages that I had the last few days. So let me just say I've got some music paper here so I might use that. On this dictionary page, and this looks like I've got some Reader's Digest or something in here. So I might work with those for the moment. So, of course, we've got to get around our window with it all. start by putting some just down now where is my rippy ruler there <coughs> just gonna neaten up this edge so I hope you're all fit and healthy haven't been watching the news at all today which is a good thing meant to get this done a lot earlier but I ended up popping out for a bit so getting to it a bit late so I've got to get heaps done now I think we'll put this piece just above the window here So I'll just make sure it fits up the top where I want it. And then bring my ruler down and lift up the paper until I can see that I'm about where I want to be to rip for our window. So that looks pretty good. It's annoying me today. So I went out the front earlier on um, because it wasn't raining and chopped back the tree that I planted on the verge to keep my neighbour happy. Don't know how she manages to back out of Coles and all the supermarkets if she can't back out of her driveway with my little tree on the verge. Anyways, got to keep your neighbours happy just in case my mail gets sent to her place again and she doesn't give it to me so I'll figure I'll keep her happy. Yeah. <laughs> I've lived here for five, six years now. Um, no hassles with the neighbours, which is great, but she's knocked on the door a few times and she's quite demanding, you know, <laughs> when she does. It's looking pretty good always do some trimming afterwards if need be. So I must go hunting for some glue tomorrow. It wasn't in spotlight last time I looked but they've got a sale on for 72 hours so I'm thinking I should go and have a look and see if there's any in there and grab a couple. So they charge like double what they should for this stuff for spotlight. It's ridiculous. I'm in a whingy mood today aren't I? Now, I suppose it doesn't matter what this music says because we're going to cover most of it anyway. So, I might just take a bit of it off like that. 
and thinking of putting that up here. Take this edge off. I think I just like messy ripped some of the stuff on the front, but I will. It's got room there. I can messy rip if I want to. Let's messy rip just this bit. Some of the edges I like straight because it's easier to put them where I want them, but it does look good with some messy bits as well. And that can go on there. Now, it doesn't matter if you don't get it right around the spine because afterwards we're going to cover the spine with some calico like we have on this one or other material, whatever you have, cotton or something. Now, I could use matte medium to stick this down and then over the top, which would probably be quicker, but I don't know, I struggle when I use any wettish sort of stuff. Um, yeah, I don't really like it much. So what I choose to do is what I did with the last time is to use my helmets to stick it down and then matte medium over the top to seal. Just works for me. this to go down this part here. That'll be nice. So I keep hitting the um, <laughs> legs to the um, shelf the last couple of days. Now, usually I would bring it over more over that way, but it isn't going to matter once we cover it, so that will be fine. So I'll just take some off the bottom here. Actually, we're putting some music page down there so if I just run it down a little bit further than the window that should be plenty so yeah I'll seal this afterwards and then I can let it dry overnight debating whether I want to put I put the Tim Holtz tissue paper on the front and back of the other one I'm still debating whether I want to do that again this time or not Good, isn't it? <laughs> no boobies allowed today. It's a bit of a joke, isn't it? <laughs> so now we need a little strip just to go down there. Now we could just choose so close to being enough, but it's not quite. Oh, there goes my chair creaking again. My iPad just decided to warn me that it was full and switch itself off. So I better empty it. Lucky it does tell me and doesn't just switch itself off or else I'd just be here doing all of this and not filming it. Oh, oops. Go from the bottom up. This is a bit 
brittle, this page. Be a bit careful with it. So that will go there and then I'll just trim it off. to the shops tomorrow and um, buy some greens to plant in my little raised garden beds since I'm starting to eat a bit healthier. It's getting near that time to start planting up the veggie beds and that. trim it. And then a little bit of music paper to put down the bottom. Now I might just try and straighten. No, I can just trim it straight afterwards. Take that little bit off. glue down on the envelope. the glue off the window there. Now I'm just going to trim down this side where we need to. Trying not to cut my envelope. Although, like I've said before, it's quite easy to patch it up, stick it back together if you need to. So that's the front cover done. Crooked there, but hey, well. All right, now to the back. So I probably did, did a similar thing. I did do music paper and cut it so it went around there. And it looks like I just did one piece down there and then a big piece across there, so that's pretty easy. So let's do something like that again. So I've got this piece. So I'm quite gonna cover that area.
it all right across there. All right. Just cut this down a little bit. because as I said before the um, calico will go over here so again I might just glue onto the envelope for this part I always stick the um, paper just onto the start of the window there because I like making sure I've covered it um, covered all of the paper and that you don't see the envelope near the window if that makes sense probably not looks good we'll trim it afterwards now I'll get some more music page Okay, length there. I'll just take a bit off of this chair. We're going to cover over that so we don't have to worry that it's going to go over that but of course we want this window to be free so the window would be about there I'm just going to try and tear it across to a little bit far but that's all right we have to stick it down So it goes around our window. I'm just going to rip this down a bit too because it doesn't need to go all that way across. Put all these oh, dropping stuff everywhere. Just trying to clean up my paper as I go. <laughs> so I don't end up with as much mess as what I usually do. Now I might make this just a tad shorter. trim the edges after. Doing. Did put a bit 
too much glue down there. That's all right. Make sure I'm not sticking my pages together. And then we just need a piece to run up here. So I'll use some of this again. I do have this piece. So I know. I think I'll get a, just a tad wide a bit. been on my son's VR for a while. I'm just thinking maybe I should go and harass him to let me on it. I've only been on it once and it was good fun. I'm such a big kid at heart. So that was hard, wasn't it? <laughs> now I've just got to trim. Awesome, so there we have the cover done. So now I reckon I will matte medium over the top and then let it dry for the night and get on with some other project. So now I've got to decide whether I could put a little bit of tissue paper on. I mean, it's not a necessity, so if you don't have any of this tissue paper stuff, don't worry about it, or if you have any napkin, or um, other tissue paper that you'd like to use. Um, it's good to put that down on your matte medium and then matte medium-ing, because <laughs> um, then you can seal over the top of that at the same time. So let me just find my, now I've got scraps of it somewhere, but I don't think I'll be able to find them in a hurry. So I'll just grab another piece. What's this one? Travel Voyage. Um, I think I want to keep that for other stuff. So I'll keep using this one, which is the Tim Holtz typography collage paper. I don't use much for this. I don't use much for anything. I just rip off the tiniest little bits. Still got heaps there. It's going to take me forever to get through that, which is good. And I'll grab my mat medium, which is behind me. And I will put away my rippy ruler, my glue, and my scissors. And I'll just move my paper bin. 
All right. And then I did use this spatula thing last time. I need more experience with it, so I might as well just use this again. I'm just debating whether I should. Which one I'd find easier to use. Yeah, just stick with this one since I'm used to it. Oh, I'll try that one. <laughs> Terrible. All right. So, I might just rip a few bits of this ready to go. Okay, I need to put two bits on the front and back. So. Very hard to rip downwards or upwards, but it's very easy to rip sideways and stuff. Any of the little bits I put in a little bin to use on other projects. All right, that should do. Oh, goodness me. I did put my grease proof on too, but I think I need a new piece on there. Because that was hard. it over and getting it to the edges because the edges are you know problem points really get knocked about and on the joins now now we do put a picture up here so I think I'll just put some up the top that we might see out the top of the picture So what I would like to do is get it on the window, just wipe it off with the tissue before it has time to dry. You have to wipe a whole lot off there now. So this is the Ranger multimedia mat that I'm using for gluing, transfer, sealing, and more. Don't ask me what the more is. Can get a little bit pricey, this sort of thing. That's why another reason why I don't mind using my helmet is to stick the stuff down and then just use this over the top.
and it's sort of tucked up. Alright, so that's the front done. So we're just going to do the back now. there so just make sure that's dry okay that should be all right I'm getting a bit more on the window than I did last time because I'm using this bigger spatula. edge sometimes. Off the window, bit up there. All right, that's not too bad. down in here somehow. So that is it for today. Good to have that done. So I'm just going to leave them alone now to dry. And then we will have to start. Oh, I didn't even put any tissue paper on. Oh, I've got a nice bit down there. Hang on. I'm going to put some tissue paper down there and up there. <laughs> and then I'll be done. It's always something, isn't there? Now, where's my spatula? Just put a tad more glue on. There, I thought I was doing so well. Just make sure that it's wet enough to stick this down. Big piece here. That will be good for about. Let's take this little bit off and I'll just wet it a little bit more. Uh, 
that's better because it is a bit plain in there and I don't put a lot of embellishment on there. Now, will this bit come out? Yes. Just going to refresh my um, baking paper. Just make sure there's a none on the outside and the top. Just make, makes it a bit easy to get off. guys so that is it for this one pretty quick and easy um so yeah let it dry now and then we'll be able to i've made like i've showed how to make some of the embellishments and that before but i figure i'll just go through the whole process why not bit by bit so it'll probably yeah like i said be little videos each day that i'm able to there might be a day or two here and there where i can't because life gets in the way but otherwise, we'll um, start making embellishments and embellishing, which will be heaps of fun to do with you all. So take care, be good, stay safe, all the rest. See you later.